FYI, the collector does not offer dental. This is <laughs> This show is so goofy. Hi everyone, welcome in, welcome back to my channel. My name is Emmy. If you're new here, it's so good to have you here. Today we are watching What If Season 1, Episode 2. What if T'Challa became a Star Lord? So we've only watched one episode of this so far and already I'm so intrigued. It's been a while since I watched something animated on YouTube and I really, really enjoy the style. I also think it's really cool to think about all these what if and alternate universes. So I don't know, I think it's just a fun and creative thing to watch. I'm super intrigued if we get to know more about the Watcher or if that's just something for this show. And I'm just really excited to see all the different situations that could result in just one small difference. But yeah, besides that, we're just going to go ahead and get into it. If you aren't already subscribed, I'd really appreciate that. Of course, a thumbs up is appreciated too. Also on my Patreon, I'm four weeks ahead. So if you're interested in both early access and full uncut timed reactions, you can check out my link for that in the description below. All right, let's go. And ponder the question. What? What, what if? if? Okay, I was a little early that time. I'm sure I'll get the hang of it sometime. But where you see light, I see worlds and the countless stories that fill Wow. Wow. And Morag? I feel like the Watcher is so cool. There's Peter. Not Spider-Man Peter. I am just an ordinary junker. But there is one oh. you may know me. Oh, we're already starting that way? Huge I'm shocked. What are you doing here? That was I thought we were going to show the change. The moment in change. Like it did last time, but instead we're just starting with him as Star-Lord. I'll get to spar with you. I guess if that's really what you want. Oh, Let's see him go. The honor of my life. I like this Star-Lord. Should I not use the gun? Go ahead. Really? Please. No, 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 no. It's not a problem. I can do it. <laughs> See, I like this show because of those silly moments like this. So spy! I'm right here. Hit me. Oh my Ooh. god! I didn't mean to. That, <laughs> that guy's funny. I barely moved. Hit me. Oh! Ooh. Classic Star Lord. Yeah, classic Star Lord. That was a good move. Well, I have hired Wes. I wonder then if it didn't show some moment of change, if it's going to go back to how he became Star-Lord. Surely, right? Maybe not. Maybe it's just like we assume it here. A Ravager never flies solo. That was a cute line for someone. It's not so <laughs> That's funny. Well, let's go. It's that weapon. And it's him. He looks really cool animated. That's my boy. It's nice to see Yondu. I wonder, I mean, he did say that's my boy. I wonder if he's still serving as like a father figure. The beginning of his journey was much more. <gasps> Yay, we do get to see it. Wakanda, 1988. Let me assure you, all you will find there is destruction and mm, sad how did we get separated though what you call destiny is just an equation ah uh, was it because he ran away like to adventure right place right time or in some instances the wrong wrong place wrong time oh man ego <sighs> <laughs> Him just saying cool. You morons grabbed the wrong kid. Uh, oh, that's funny. Two sea holes, two here holes, one eight hole, everything. <laughs> that's generally what humans look like. Oh, all humans look alike to me. The cop wings <laughs> where he was took nearly broke. Interesting. You freaked out about all this, kid. What you doing out there all by yourself anyway? He's adventuring. Yeah, exploring. So did they never pick up Peter? That's interesting. Twenty years later? Well, it's kind of sad because Peter's story, like he lost his mom and he didn't have a dad. And I feel like that's maybe why he never wanted to go back to Earth. 
But it's interesting that T'Challa doesn't want to go back to Earth. Like, I know he loves exploring, but surely he misses Wakanda and his family. The Mad Titans are decimating half of the universe. Oh, no. I'm a big enough man to admit when I'm wrong. What? <laughs> Reallocate the universe's resources. Oh my Sometimes god. In your He's still around? Although I still assert my plan was not without its merits. <laughs> and he calls Star-Lord Commander. That's wild. <laughs> Man, alternate universes are wild. Hey, uh, I have guess. <laughs> Wait, you are the Star-Lord. Look at him animated. We're still gonna be besties, right? To send to my wife and daughter. I would prefer- ah. He still has his wife and daughter. He looks pretty good from where I'm standing. Nebula. Oh, that's Nebula? I wouldn't have guessed. She has hair. You still wear your past around your neck. You ever think of going mm. back? No. Yeah, do you? Why? Yandu attempted to return me to Wakanda, but it had been destroyed. Oh. Wow. Just another senseless war. That's awful. Halo, the size we're talking. We could feed billions of people on millions of wells and eradicate wow. hunger across. Wow. This seems like a pretty good alternate universe so far. You mean she's your offspring? Adopted. Adopted. It's a long story. <laughs> I've been trying to get him into counseling. So who's <laughs> into family counseling? That's funny. The collector, as in the most ruthless kingpin in the intergalactic. Oh, the collector. FYI, the collector does not offer dental. This is <laughs> This show is so goofy. So long as the collector's involved, we are not. Yondu has spoken. Just like that earthling folk hero of yours, right? Robin Leach. Robin who? Robin Leach. <laughs> Yondu and I will pose as sellers looking to unload that orb you recovered on Morak. But really, it'll be T'Challa inside. Ooh, sneaky plan. It's when you cause the distraction. He? <laughs> Stop! I thought we were faking! That's funny. Try calling me Captain Genocide again, new guy. Oof. Oh my god. This is goofy, especially having Thanos on our team. Tanelir Tavan, the Collector. Oh my Dang. dearest Nebula. I don't remember his fur coat looking like that in the movies. Soon get on with it. All business. And to think I'm old and... He also wasn't buff, was he? Like his face looked the same, but not his body, right? I do remember Astro Dog. Ah. We should free him. Yeah, we're small if you catch my drift. You are quite articulate for a duck. That duck was in the movie too. Take a Louie at the Frost Giants, a Hard Ralph at the Cronus. You're gonna see a sign for Elvish literature? Ignore that. Total. S okay, I'm lost. Give me the tour. Good. That was a lot of steps. I was not gonna remember those directions. It's a diversion. Sound the alarms. Lock down the building. Uh oh. We're running out of time. Hold on. I need to hydrate. <laughs> There's just some bar in here. Dude, we we gotta to go. go. We no, we really gotta go. Ooh. The Wakanda music. There are people in here? Oh, okay, okay. That's freaky. My son, T'Challa, crown prince of Wakanda, oh. was abducted <gasps> from Earth by an alien. Oh no, this is heartbreaking. Whereabouts, we ask that you respond to this homing beacon. Oh no. You are one bright, burning light in the night sky of Billy. Please. Every last one of them until we find you on this plane or the next. Oh my god, that is heart wrenching. God. The fact that he never went back, that's gotta hurt. Oh, Cha-Cha. I hope you can understand. I had a debt with a collector. Nebula. I'm not surprised. I guess people can't change that much in alternate universes. Told me my homeland had been destroyed. My family killed. How is that protecting me? Whoa. Oh. Oh. I thought maybe it could have been destroyed after. 
Oh, wow. Yondu really lied like that. You don't belong down there with them. You belong up here with us, with your family. He literally still has family at Wakanda. I mean, he they could be found family, but he still has other family. So that's an interesting difference about Peter versus T'Challa as Star-Lord. I simply abhor drama. <laughs> your outfit would suggest otherwise. <laughs> that's what I was thinking. That is quite a coat that I just haven't been able to find the right piece for. Mm. I am just an ordinary human. Oh, I think I remember what that girl does, right? He does have a superpower after all. He can bore someone to death using only his sanctimony. I thought he was going to call him super annoying. Sect him and strip his remains for parts. <gasps> it's that guy, Squidward. Oh my God, it's been so long since we've seen Squidward. To my best friend T'Challa. You are the worst! Yes, Nebula, you are the worst. Oh? But then again, there are two sides. <laughs> I'm confused. And what does he want? In a word, you, Chacha. I had no idea about that. Oh. Okay, so we're not mad at Me Nebula. Interesting. Classic Star Lord. Hey, it was T'Challa's idea to keep you in the dark. Because he knew I would mm. never let him. Okay, that's fair. Oh, damn. You guys are good. Yeah, I'm impressed. Close to his chest. No, not like that, Karina. Oh. <gasps> He's gonna use those? Let's go. Uh-oh. Squidward was powerful. What are we gonna do? Those handcuffs look like they would hurt a ton. Let's go. Thing you said about not locking people in cages. Thank you. Oh, that's nice. Dang, he's got a punch on him. God, the animation is like beautiful. I'm really impressed by all the colors and whatnot. In dark matter, taken from the ruler of the hmm. dark. He has a shield in there too. Elegant. Oh my god! And he has Harris crown? Courtesy of the Asgardian goddess. Isn't of that interesting? He really has quite the collection. I mean, well deserved name for him. Run! We were running! Okay, <laughs> That's funny. Get to the ship. Let's go, Thanos. God, who would have ever thought I was gonna say that? We like Thanos fighting for us. What a nice, welcome change of pace. Is Nebula gonna go back to help him? Never flies solo. Let's go, Yondu. It's a good thing Yondu knows the plan now. Leave here without my kid. Without my kid. That's so sweet. Uh oh, we're getting beat up on all ends. Oh, lordy. You okay, Thanos? Nebula's here. Good old familial bonds in this episode. Oh, wow. She's giving it to him? <laughs> Holy cow. <laughs> it's like Jack and the Beanstalk in here. See, I love that. Like last episode, it was the Hydra being a little crazy, and now it's this Jack and the Beanstalk. What about Yandu and T'Challa? I'm sure they're doing fine. They were, in fact, not doing fine. Yeah! There they go. Kind of. Okay, never mind. Sticky fingers. Could work. Who's the clue? You are. Because you lied to me. What is sticky fingers? Ooh, the music. <laughs> Look at that. 
Animation is so cool. Oh, I have some ideas. <laughs> Let's go, girly. Stop and think. I took care of all of you. I put a Stop and head. think. Oh, God. Also, him telling them stay as if they're pets, please. All crew members present and accounted for by some. Where's Rocket? By the way. <gasps> Yay! We did free the Astro Dog. Best day. But now, knowing everything, I'm not quite sure where I belong. You can belong in both worlds. There ain't no place in this galaxy where you don't belong. Aww, that's so sweet. So he gets to return to Wakanda? That's so exciting. And his dad's still here. And look, his mom and sister too. My son, I knew you would find your way home to us. Oh, that's so sweet. Uh, pleased to meet you, sir. Your son is a galactic hero. <laughs> what a happy ending. Oh, no, no, because it's random. Uh -huh. And I might add. <laughs> oh, my God. That's funny. This job. I was lost, Baba. Yandu found me. That's nice. He made Yandu look better than what he was actually doing. Oh, my God. Is this what Peter has been up to? A janitor? Or maybe just a fast food worker? Uh, sorry, we're close. Come on, Peter. A Can't dairy queen. A time for dear old dad. Oh, but wow. Mm, I want to hear that story. Wow. So he never got abducted. Oh. That's such a sweet ending. That was special. Friends, thank you so much for watching What If Episode 2 with me. What a special, special episode. I mean, I don't know if I even ever had the thought, what if T'Challa was Star-Lord? But I loved seeing how it all played out and how some things were different and some people and situations were very similar to how they were. I think this was a really special episode to dedicate to Chadwick because I, it was just a really good story to call him a hero and then at the end he returns home and it, it's just it was kind of overall like a very happy episode yeah that was special i highly enjoyed that thank you again so much for watching with me and until i see you in the next video i hope you stay hydrated stretch your legs please don't get arrested and i will see you then goodbye <laughs>